Well, hello there, my awesome listeners. It is your host here once again. It is Team Rai Rai. Now, before I go any further, I was just wondering, anyone out there on social media had a chance to listen to the podcast from earlier today? If not, smash that bell. You will get a notification from YouTube. Now, if that doesn't work, hit the subscribe, um, hit the like button, leave a comment. There's always will be an article down below or a link. You guys and gals could figure it out for yourself because you guys are very, very smart people. So hopefully you guys enjoy the very first one of the day and the one for right now. Now it is time once again to discuss wrestling news, wrestling topics, and a lot of interesting topics to discuss for you. So sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, grab some, <coughs> excuse me, grab some drink. Now if you don't do not like that, maybe you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts and opinions on a certain topic and of course the article will be down below. Now if I repeat myself from this one and earlier, I'm sorry, I'm trying to get over this head cold so I apologize for that. Let's get this started. Anyway, I attended my very first W Hall of Fame back in 2014. It was a very awesome experience, but it dragged out. So, oh my gosh, I know these wrestlers want to tell us life story, but they should have a time limit. And I know you're going to say, no, let the wrestlers say whatever they want to say on their dumb, sorry, on their darn minds. You know, there's no limit, and whatever. I remember that time, was it back in 2014? I forgot when it was that Mr. T got a little weight carried away. And then, of course, they have, have to have Kane come out on stage and tell him, Mr. T, uh, you're done. That's going to be very embarrassing. And I don't think Mr. T's all there anyway. Anyway. <coughs> Speaking of the W Hall of Fame, the W Hall of Fame is a early, sorry, a year celebration of pro wrestling in the past. They, the celebration cement has become a pretty long order to sit through you right yep and some superstars don't even make it through Goldberg's speech before last year's this is the one reason why he thinks the W Hall of Fame is stupid number one I mentioned this last year or before because they put nonsense people in there you know in my opinion okay I know you have a different opinion they drag it out they need to have a, a time limit they do it for the other awards so if they could do it then we could do it you know but let's see if this does happen you know this will be the only time I will ever attended Hall of Fame it's not worth it you know the only reason I attended because Moshman got inducted no, I know he was not there. He was there in spirit, but Hulk Hogan inducted him and his own brother did, you know? They did his little speech, but I guarantee you, if Marshman was, was there, it'd be ten times better speeches for both of them. No offense to those guys. Now, I know why it took so long to put Marshman because he had a little beef with McMahon. I wish they could bury the hatchet way before he passed away, but that's how things are these days. It seemed like it, you know? So what do you think? Do you think WWE should have a time limit with the W Hall of Fame? Or do you think that they should have no time limit? I think they should. It's sad. I feel sorry for the people who's got to sit through these long speeches. And some of them could be very good. Some of them could be very dragged out. Like I told you earlier, Mr. T. I don't think he was very there. I think he's, he's a very sick person. I don't know. Or I don't know what's wrong with him. He's not... He, it seems like he's not all there. I could be wrong. I could be right. Who knows? And then they have to have Kane come from backstage and tell Mr. T, you're done, you know? He keeps saying, Mama, Mama, you know? All that stuff. So, I know he's getting up there in age, you know? So, I'll put the article down below if you want to read it for yourself. So, I think they should have a time limit and make these uh, speeches shorter, you know? I think the only time they make it longer is to the person who closed out the show. You guys agree? Disagree? I know this is not the longest discussion. 
<coughs> excuse me, because I'm trying to get over this head cold again. So, everyone out there, enjoy your rest of your Saturday. I uh, will be back tomorrow sometime. Like, subscribe, leave a comment, hit the notification, hit the subscribe. The article will be down below. If anyone out there on social media wants to check it out for themselves, have a good one. And hopefully I get better soon. And I'm sorry I repeat myself from this one and the one from earlier today. Hopefully you guys accept my apology. Later.